right, so here he is, one of the best boxers on this UFC roster, and if this fight was to be contested under the Marquess of Queensbury rules, it would be no contest, but we got an MMA fight here. We tonight. would be talking about a one-round fight, because right. there are no fighters in the UFC that can compete with this guy in that one form of combat. Such a great jab, the head movement. It's never on a line. He's constantly going left to right, right to left. It's like a triangle, he's moving. You can never see a stationary target in his approach. And what I truly love about him is his ability to really dig that left body shot, yeah. to try and find the liver to end fights. We don't see knockouts like that very often. This man has done this a number of times in the UFC. The sweet science. Some oh, people dude. think boxing is simple. It is anything but. This fighter has certainly mastered it. Well, this is exciting here, DC. The founder of Jeet Kune Do, one of the founding fathers, really, of mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee is back in a big spot here tonight. Bruce Lee is what every kid looked to when they thought about doing karate. Bruce Lee is the person that anyone looked at when they said, I want to be a fighter. It was the speed. It was the charisma. It was the approach of Bruce Lee that made him so special. And tonight, he's going to look to show a new generation of fighters exactly how it's supposed to be done. And if you hear the phrase, drillers make killers, right? I mean, that was Bruce Lee in a nutshell. He felt like practice yes. would make yes. perfect. Nobody trained as hard as the great Bruce Lee. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, a referee in charge of the octagon, Eve Loving. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a boxer making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet six inches tall, weighing in at 206 pounds. Awesome! And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee. Okay, guys, protect yourself at all time, obey my command at all time. If you want to touch glove, do it now, go back to your corner. They touch gloves and we are underway. kick landed by this gentleman. All right, early round one here. Big reach advantage, DC. We'll see if he can employ that patented jab. Yes, he has to maintain distance. He's the taller guy. So every time his opponent tries to enter, he's going to have to take something on the way inside. Powerful punch lands. Now he gets back to range. It's such a fast leg kick. Beautiful combination there. And both guys really throwing with authority. Unable to connect with the right. Nice kick. Well, that left hand has been there at times, not on that attempt. And he landed the right hand there. It's very tricky when he throws that body kick. He's 
throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Good series of strikes for him there, staying busy and staying accurate. I mean, the accuracy is unbelievable. Beautiful technique on the straight right hand. He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. Oh, single collar tie here. Oh, perfect head kick there. Big roundhouse now, just misses. Nice. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. He loaded up there on that high kick. Came of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Caught that kick there. Oh, big head kick lands. And he connects there, DC. Great job landing that punch. Right, let's take a look back at some of the highlights from those previous five minutes, DC. And uh, no padding, no glove on that foot. No glove, no padding. And look at the hip action when he throws those kicks. He's not only kicking just for feel, he's really trying to damage his opponent. And as the fight goes longer, you will start to see it taking effect. Come on, let's get this together now. All right, second round now underway. I'm no analyst, but a little bit of a feeling out process there. In my and that's a part of being in the octagon with someone that's so skilled. You cannot just go after the guns of blazing. Both of these young men are trying to find the right moment to attack. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Big body kick. Well, that body kick was... Oh! All right, so he's landed some good shots. You hate to be overly critical, but nothing really in terms of combinations tonight. Well, the jab has been looking great. How about jab, jab, right hand? Right. Because eventually you're gonna have to put something on your opponent that's gonna really make him pause. I believe the jab has been working so well, if he drops his big right hand after it, he may be able to finish his fight. Lands with the kick there, no pad on that foot. No shit guard. He's taking all of that kick every time he throws. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Wow! He's in trouble. He's hurt fast. Good movement by him here, transitioning very well on the ground side. Step for step, he's staying with his opponent in every transition. Oh, and he's able to land a strike there from the bottom. Nicely done by Lee. Oh, his opponent squirming like a fish out of water now. The ground and pound is on point. This could very well be the beginning of the end. This could be the beginning of the end. We've seen some really good ground and pound fighters. This young man is as good as any we've ever seen. Strong defense there to block the shot. Nice instincts. Well, he's really starting to land a high number of strikes here in the second round. No denying that he has taken the message from his corner and picked up the pace here in round two. I mean, he's cutting them down the side with these beautiful leg kicks. Big kick lands. Well, he's got the longer reach, and he certainly showed it there in landing that straight punch. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Stuffs that takedown attempt without issue. All right, 20 seconds to go in the round. Lands with the right hand. Over and over to land these big body kicks. Ten minutes in the books. Well, he
He had a lot more than a puncher's chance coming in. Big knockdown for him in the previous round. DC, talk us through the highlight. He got in his opponent's face, landed that big punch that put his opponent flat on his back. He couldn't get the finish, but if he lands one more time just like that, he will get the victory. All right, so back-to-back -back entertaining rounds. We'll see how it goes in this round. We'll see which corner sort of maximized those 60 seconds. This is what happens. Very skilled, very evenly matched fighters coming together. Nobody has really taken a lead in this fight. Let's see who does it going into the next round. Tried to go to the body, but unable to connect. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. Oh, he missed with that right hand. Lee gets tagged with a kick now. Let's see if he can wrap. And they separate. He misses with the right hand. Oh! Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Both fighters throwing heat now. Just over three minutes to go in round three. Well placed kick there by Lee. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, he might be out. take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Nice kick. Oh, big roundhouse attempt, just misses. Head kick attempt, gets blocked. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. All right, he'll engage in a single collar tie. Ooh, what a punch. Able to check the high kick. Oh, that right hand is on point. And they separate. Lee gets hit by that leg kick. You may want to start checking some of these. Whoa! What a fight so far. All right, so a high-level round there for him. We'll show you some of the action here, and you got to think the knockdown is going to be featured prominently here. Thought he might have had him out of there. He thought he had him, but the guy's tough. The guy's durable. He has a fantastic chin, but he just needs to stay the course. He does not need to be discouraged. Think about this. You're winning, and you're winning going away. That was just a moment. Keep going in the same direction, and you will get the finish that you want so bad. advantage off the top. Made good use of it there with that punch, DC. Well, you didn't see a lot of the body work from him in the earlier rounds, but he's certainly getting after it here. Big shot to the body connects there. We'll see if he can follow it up. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Right hand upstairs! Big leg kick lands. Nice, sneaky head kick. 
Oh, oh, he might be out. Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Ooh, he landed a huge hook there. strike that was. What a strike that he is landing over and over. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got to be hurt very bad. Final seconds of round four. Look at the whip action. That How about those five minutes? So there's the horn signifying the end of the round. We had a knockdown there, but not a knockout. No, it wasn't a knockout, but you can't take those shots. That big punch landed, and it sat him down. If he gets hit with another one of those, it might be good night, Irene. It is the fifth and final round. Effective strike there by Lee. Oh, really using his reach advantage as he landed the jab there. Oh! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish. Whoa! is pretty comfortable on the ground, DC, but you got to be very careful hanging out here for too long if you're his opponent. Keep it busy here off of his back. Nice offense from the bottom. Continuing to work out of the half guard. Ooh, found a home for that knee. Wow! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Oh! He's hurt. He's hurt bad. Well, he works hard. Oh! Huge right hand! Slay kick checked nicely by Lee. Oh, he's landed a high number of total strikes here in the latter stages of this fight. He's really picked up the... Oh! He's out! It's over! It's over! <laughs> you knew if he landed that weapon repeatedly, it could be a short night for his opponent, but that was just one perfectly placed strike that his opponent candidly didn't even see coming. It landed flush and 
and the rest, as they say, is history. Big knockout win for him here tonight. So a huge result and a seminal moment for him here tonight as he gets the big knockout win. That could hold up as one of the better KOs of the year. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Leving has called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 49 seconds of round number five. Declaring the winner by knockout, Bruce the Dragon.